I hate politics, I love revolution. So vo fighting for a candidate would have been politics and it would have really ruined what I essentially love about this process and ruined what, I, what essentially makes me really committed to it. Um, I commit myself to people's stories and military trials for civilians have been, this campaign has, has been all about this, about telling the stories of those in prison who did not have a chance to tell the stories. And also in the process, you actually help the revolution because essentially you are um, campaigning against one of the most powerful tools of Supreme Council of Armed Forces. And therefore you are campaigning against one of the most powerful tools of the counter-revolution. This is part of my frustration with the foreign media, is that they come here and like over the past year, and they always want to ask about the topics that I don't think are important. So they want to ask about the role of women, and they want to ask about fear of Islamists, um, and of course hopes for the revolution and all of that. And we keep on telling them that for us there are more critical issues. We are still dealing with torture, we are still dealing with mass detention, unfair trials. Sometimes I find myself thinking, if this is what, like, if this is what people want, an Islamic version of the revolution, then just let's go through it so they would understand it's not, it, it, it doesn't work. I think parliamentary elections were a very uh, good um, test for people. They voted on mostly on Muslim Brotherhood who are there and they failed them. And, and I'm not talking about about me or my friends, I'm talking about really people in the street. They failed them. You'd find a lot of ordinary people complaining about how they stood in, uh, in rows for hours just to give their vote to Muslim Brotherhood and they completely failed them and they won't give them their vote. I didn't care about elections from the beginning, so I don't feel like I lost at all. Um, I actually don't feel... I don't feel we are the losers at this point. I know it's very... It seems very gloomy. And... I just think there's something very refreshing about being through this. Like, I was not interested in politics. My, my parents were from the beginning. Me and my younger sister, we weren't on different degrees. And suddenly this, it, it's, it's, it's a life-changing experience. Like, people think I'm a lawyer just because I'm working so, you know, focused on military trials. So I'm, I don't think we are the losers. I think we are discovering new aspects to our life. We are discovering new tools. We are actually <clears throat> setting new initiatives and new models for other people to learn from. I do hope we manage to get it to, to the end and to actually be victorious but then if we don't which i doubt <laughs> then we would have we would have really tried we would have really tried and maybe we would have set an example for someone else some you know another place in in the world to take on and develop further yeah